and they'll all look at their iPads. That's what they have in eighth grade. They'll all look at their iPads. I love the name of this one. Who has Give a Hoot New Tech Kahoot? Give a Hoot New Tech Kahoot. Nobody? Okay, nobody in this room. This is going to be a completely different experience than what they're going to offer at the ninth grade center. At the ninth grade center, they go to three stations. But at the end, we're gonna say, hey, do you kind of like our school? Would you like to participate in a Flex Friday on a Saturday? If you and your family wanna come up and experience the Flex opportunity that we have, the Flex experience, you remember to advertise the Saturday event, the Saturday Flex experience. Let me start with, let me start with trust cards. Yay! I love that. I love that. I love that. Or what if you gave them three things, everybody three different things, you're like, you have to create something, go. Um, I had a project that was due, so I sent my parents to 7-Eleven at 10 o'clock at night so that they could buy a poster board. They brought it back. I quickly scribbled something on the front of it. I wrote my name on the back of it, and I turned it in the next day, and that was my project. And that's the difference between a poster project and project-based learning. Here, it's like build golf courses that are going to shoot a hole in one. Construct them. You have to think about your geometry. You have to think about your angles. Yeah? All right, that's all I have. Is it time to go? Yeah. This concludes our mic'd up session with Mr. Lee. Mr. Lee, thank you so much for making this session possible. You're very welcome. Thank there you. There was a lot of good moments in it. Excellent. Have a good day. Have a great day. Bye-bye. We'll see you guys later. Thanks. Striking. Can I get some help with this? Oh, please. Take one. Action. Hi, my name is Maya, and I'm 16 years old, and I'm not exactly sure why I'm on here, but I'm just gonna give you my day to day life. I can't. <laughs> Hi, my name is Maya, and I'm 16 years old, and I'm not exactly sure why I'm here, but I'm just gonna give my day to day life routine. So every day I wake up to my obnoxious alarm, and it has to be obnoxious, otherwise, I won't get up. And then I go and brush my hair. And patience Ow! is not a virtue that I possess, but that's okay. It's okay. So normally, I start like, um, I, I start. So normally I start my day like any other. It's pretty slow as usual. And then once I get out of the door, it's actually pretty late. So I go and get my lunch, my food from Sonic. And people typically judge me for the size drink that I get at Sonic, but I just can't help that it's that good. Um, by the way, do you mind if I play some music? This is my favorite part! <laughs> hi, welcome to Sonic. What can I get for you today? Um, hi, can I please have a cherry, a Route 44 cherry limeade? What are you doing? It's not that hard. That's what it's like being me. Communists are a fun bunch. Okay, that makes me real nervous. Um, please don't be Volker. <laughs> Come on. Um, 
I will run you over. Is that like a car? I feel like this is something that I'm gonna be sitting on a stand at some point and testifying about. I will run you over. Mr. Ruiz? Oh, score. And I'll talk to him later. Communists are a fun bunch. Volker Ruiz or you? You glow. Ruiz? Volker. Okay, I need to talk to Volker more. We strive on controversy. Broad Street. Yeah. That was easy. Uh, there is too much slaying going on. Hufford. Sura. You glow? Like murder Shakespeare or slay as in like slay? I see. I don't. I don't. Mm. I think I could take Volker. Nothing against the guy, but he's in dad mode. <laughs> He'd be holding back. I've got nothing to lose. <laughs> okay. Uh, that seems like a hunter. No, you glow. Okay, that seems like something I should facilitate. I feel like I, we could make that happen. Can I help you? Why is there a rat in the printer? This rat has a name, kid. What's your name? None of your business. How do you think all the copies get made? Uh, technology? No. Since when is that reliable? My family has worked this printer for decades. My carpal tunnel is hereditary. So, you make all the copies by hand? By claw, technically. Whatever. How long have you been doing this? Fifteen long years, kid. I've had a chiropractor since the mousetrap incident of 2009. Now close the drawer. My tiny rat eyes can't handle the light for too long. You gonna print my paper? And don't rats live for only, like, two years? Well... You kids these days need to learn some respect. And no, I don't think I would. Fine, I'll find another rat!